Ciao a tutti ragazzi e benvenuti a in questo nuovo video di Telafarais Bene, finalmente possiamo continuare sperando che non ci siano troppi filmati come negli scorsi episodi Che mi è diventato un film, non più un gioco E quindi vediamo un po' cosa dice il piedistallo su cui posa Rena Alma tre secoli fa Ora non mostra alcuna traccia di poter residuo Beh, non so se essere contento o no, però comunque sì, ah, andiamo avanti Uh, dove non lo so adesso giro un po' per vedere se c'è qualcosa ma a quanto pare non sembra uh, mi tocca tornare cioè andare avanti nel senso di qua e vediamo un po' sperando che non ci sia un altro filmato come l'ho detto <ride> mi scappa da vita vabbè andiamo a vedere vai teletrasporta chi ci Vediamo dove e come fare per ammazzare tutti. Qui non c'è niente, vero? No, andiamo pure. Ecco, un altro filmato. Beh, la cosa nuova, dai. That's quite some door, all right. This might finally be it. The heart of the beast. We'll find the Renis Alma and the Red Woman inside, right? After everything we've been through to get here, they damn well better be. We'll probably be needing you to open this one for us, Sovereign. Go for it, Alfin. This is it, guys. Time to see what secrets are in store. Bene, vediamo se eh, cosa fare più che altro. Ok, sentiamo. We're a long way from the residential quarters now. It looks completely different. Yeah, you're right. Actually, this place. It reminds me more of being back inside the wedge. Except the Dan and Astral energy feels even stronger here. In a portion of the city reserved purely for the Renin Sovereign. Maybe he just has strange tastes? This place looks like it has been here for quite some time now. If its design were a matter of personal preference, we would be talking from centuries ago. Or perhaps even further back. Still... This isn't the sort of decadence of taste spoken of in artistic circles. So what is it then? Hold up, decadence? Artistic circles? When a preference is indulged to its extreme, it descends into kitsch, eccentricity for the sake of it. I'd be happy to illuminate you further. That depends. Does it involve you buying me lunch? The void that art fills isn't the stomach. It's the soul. In that case, I'll let you know the next time my soul starts to rumble. Now all we need is something to fill up the void inside your head. Shut up! Ma che bella scenetta. Vabbè, eh, sì, ripristiniamoci, va che è meglio. E vediamo un po' come va la storia. Volron! He really was still alive. And there's the Renis Alma. Then, is this another spirit channeling ceremony? Wait, though. Something doesn't seem right here. Oh, once more. The powers must be united. Born from the fires of chaos, the world does seek its rightful state. All must be sacrificed in the heart of Rena, at the shrine of the true sovereign. A lot has happened to him. He's lost himself, reduced to a mere cog in a machine. Hey, look! Over there! Isn't that the Maiden's Crest? Can it be that this entire chamber is meant to act as a substitute for the Maiden? It looks like it's still running, but are we already too late to stop the ceremony? If that's what caused Lenegus' transformation, then the purpose of the ceremony must have been to drain all the astral energy out of Dana. 
But for what purpose? What could possibly need astral energy on that sort of scale? I don't know. But whatever it is, I'll bet it's connected to those visions of oblivion. Regardless, we cannot stand by and let them steal Dana's energy. That said, we should retrieve the Renis Alma. Because right now, we need that most of all. He's not gonna lunge at us out of nowhere, right? Not the time, Law. Alfin, look! The Red Woman! So we finally found you. I have a lot of questions for you. Wait! What? They all have the same face? How is that even possible? <clears throat> what is this? Who the hell are they? It can't be. Are they even people? It's hard to know for sure, but I think they're the true rulers of Rena. Oh, porca vacca! Opla! Vediamo che succede. Certo che è interessante, per carità, eh. Ok, 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 rilassati però, eh. eh è un etondo. Adesso è un po' che non gioco, quindi giocherò di merda, però insomma... Che senso. Però dai, un po' di danni glieli facciamo. Cioè, è più il tempo che passo in aria che il tempo che passo. Ok. Perfetto. Ah, a me va bene, eh, cioè per carità, nel senso. Ok. A cazzarola Ok Ok This is some punishment You pay for that Porca vacca Ok Ah non posso farlo Vai Vediamo qualcosa di veramente grosso 3000 Tutti quanti Perfetto Ok Dai, male non sta andando Stiamo facendo abbastanza danni Ok Ok, vai, vai, fatti abbastanza i danni, dai. Benissimo. Porca vacca. Questa non me l'aspettavo proprio di una faccia. Eh, vai. 
Perfetto. Ok. Perfetto. Runo tondo, runo tondo. Perfetto. Andata. Surrender. Fighting is useless now. Do you think it's really over? Astral energy. Watch out. They've got something up their sleeve. <coughs> What? It's self-destructed? Helfen! I'm okay. Just a little roughed up. You had me worried there. Who said you could touch that? Damn it! He's awake! Hmm. I should have thought as much. So you know this place? Naturally. It was built for me, after all. We'll save that for another time. More pressing is how I'm going to tear you apart. Even after all this time, you still insist on hating me? You cut me down. Sovereign or not, you will pay for that. <laughs> You're obviously bluffing. You can't even move right now. Really, is that what you think? Did you really think that such a petty device could hold me? Are you going to claim it's because you're a ruler? Be it sovereigns or lords. In the end, they're all titles given by someone else. Plus, what kind of ruler would spend all his time chasing Alf, who happens to be another sovereign? Idle prattle. I proved my worth and the sovereign's powers were granted to me. Were they really? We already know the title of sovereign doesn't denote royalty. It is but an overblown codename for those with a designated part to play in these proceedings. You mentioned before that you were not the only one stolen from Dana, correct? Yeah. There were countless. And every one of them besides me... died. All of those failed experiments, and they still kept going back to Dana. There must have been some vital reason their subject had to specifically be a Danan. Then there were the records we found in the library, for you and Volron. They were locked 300 years apart, and yet the data they took from you was exactly the same. Which leads us to a single conclusion. Then you mean... Boron was kidnapped just like Alfin? But then he became a... A slave from Dana. Just like us. Isn't that right, Volron? Hmm. So he posed as a Renin and caused all that suffering to his own people? How could you? If you knew the pain of being a slave, why would you inflict that upon others? <laughs> Renin and Danon are meaningless distinctions. Me and everyone else. That is all that matters. <laughs> I will stand above all others and take what is rightfully mine, starting with this. <clears throat> <sighs> <sighs> A red woman? Another one? Give your master back on Rena this message. No one makes a fool of me. Let them know I'll make them suffer. Don't do it! <laughs> Like, 
can't stay here. We need to go. Alfred! I will be your shadow no matter where you try to run. Let's go. Never forget, I am the one who devours everything. Who answers to neither spirit nor man. My word is law. I am... I am... Are you two okay? Yeah. We'll be fine. Is Volron... Have we finally seen the last of him? We can but hope. Those red women... What the heck was their deal? Could they be the ones behind all this? The same ones who put those soldiers and Faria in a trance? What? Those brainless things? <sighs> Either way, they've done a runner with the Renesalma. Damn it, that's the second time now! Whatever's stolen from us, we'll steal it back. The future's ours to protect. And right now, those things are what's standing in our way. We can head them off at Rena. Did you say Rena? Volron mentioned a master of theirs holed up in the Motherland somewhere. If that monstrous forms their true identity, I shudder to think who they take orders from. Yeah. There's a good chance it's not human. That's for sure. So this thing over on Rena, that's what's really behind all this, huh? They have the Rena Salma in their grasp already, so it's unlikely they'll have cause to return to Dana. I agree that Rena's our best shot. Then we're agreed. Let's head back to the starship. But seriously, I was not expecting Voron to actually be here. He seemed to care not one whit about Frenin's or Danon's. Yeah, not in a good way like with us. Beh ragazzi, direi che è andata piuttosto bene. Poi beh, dove devo andare? Devo andare al corridoio. Come ci arrivo al corridoio? Le domande... Eh, mi hai tolto il teletrasportico, quindi tocca farlo a piedi. Poca vacca. Io un po'. Dovrebbe essere più o meno qua, eh. Adesso mi ricordo bene, ma... Uh, Cosa è successo? I didn't see that coming about Volron. As for those red women, to think they were monsters all along. Tell me about it. One minute they look perfectly human. Next thing you know, they're not actually human at all. They definitely weren't Renan or Danan. I'm not even sure language would get through to them. So what were they then? Human Zoogle hybrids? Is the most terrifying thing anyone said all day. How about you, Shion? Doheling? You ever seen anything like that before? No, never. However, if they're the same as the red woman we've seen with Volron, I think it's safe for us to assume they understand our language at the very least. I had just so much I wanted to ask them. About Rena and Shion's thorns. Unfortunately, they blew themselves up before we got the chance. Why would they do such a thing, though? To take us with them? 
Or in order to keep something hidden. Both sound plausible to my ears. They took off with the Renis Alma too, remember? Yeah, they did. And the next time we meet them, we're going to make sure they tell us everything they know. Bene ragazzi, direi che magari ci possiamo anche fermare qui per questo video è tutto. Io vi invito come al solito a lasciare un like, un commento, se piace la serie, il punto di farmi sapere cosa ne pensate. Poi il momento video è solo la Ciao ciao!